for somebody like me. I've been looking for somebody like you. Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Leora. If you're new here, obviously today I'm not wearing scrubs. That's because I have my basics presentation today and public speaking is not like my strong suit so <laughs> I'm a little nervous but I'm trying to tell myself like nice things so that I don't psych myself out I think a lot of things if you kind of just put your mind to it and you can kind of fool yourself into thinking that you're more confident than you are so that's what I'm gonna try to do today <laughs> Um, I'm talking about normal anatomy for my fourth year's patient, so I will probably talk about it more when I am finished, but for now it's like almost 7.25. I need to head over there because our presentation starts at 7.45 and I just want to be there early. He's not bad. How was basics? <laughs> How's your presentation? Vicky and I presented today. I kid you not, my throat was like this. It was closing. <laughs> you know when you're like nervous? Anaphylactic shock. Right? I was like, and I was holding my, um, these notes. Yeah. My ass, the, the font is so small. <laughs> How the heck would you read that? So I was like, <laughs> you didn't even look at it. You were just doing this with the paper. <laughs> Why did you print it so <laughs> small? <laughs> <laughs> diabetes. Is. Diabetes. I'd like to talk to you for a few minutes about diabetes. My case was fine. I was confident, and then my voice was a little shaky towards the end. I'm glad my friends did not show up. Otherwise, I probably would have cried. <laughs> like, okay, help me. I was like, who's she talking to? She's walking. Hello. <laughs> to the um, what's your what's your YouTube name? Wow, fail. My YouTube Edited name. <laughs> my YouTube Sorry, name is I, my name. How can you forget that? Are she vlogging? <laughs> that was actually very good acting. Ten out of ten. <laughs> I've never, I've never talked about OHP, so basically, what do we learn? <clears throat> it's a class where we... Uh, this is exactly how I feel about OHP, like, <laughs> being put on the spot all the time with little time to prepare. We always, we always <laughs> are in groups and we make Andy talk if he's in our yeah. group, because he's the president, so, duh. <sighs> I'm a go-to guy. <laughs> yeah, I just kind of sit back and watch, but we all <laughs> have to, like, answer a question usually. It's like really important information. It is, it's very important. Like we talk about water fluoridation, we talk about dental therapy and like... But at the same time, it's like we feel that we don't always need to have a class session for everything. <laughs> like lectures are fine. Okay, so obviously it's a different day. It's Tuesday and I had class this morning. It is 12.45. I'm going to eat lunch really quick because I have operative at 1. It's really nice in Boston today. It's 62 degrees. It's really, really nice out. So, I didn't go to a lecture this morning. We had two lectures. It was gonna be from nine to 11. Uh, I guess one of our professors was a little late. <laughs> so they had to figure that out somehow, but it ended up working out, it's fine. But it's just funny, this is the first time we've had a professor late, so that was interesting. I wasn't there, but I just obviously saw it through group messages and stuff. Um, so I didn't go to lecture, I just took the morning and kind of relaxed, had some pancakes, had some orange juice, and just enjoyed my morning. And I also needed to clean my house because it was getting a little gross. <laughs> so that's what happens when you have a dog, you have dog hair everywhere. So I needed to just make sure that I felt clean. Okay, so it looks like an operative today, we will be having a presentation on class five slash root carries and then we'll be just doing whatever after that practicing number six which is what we just learned i don't think i'll be working on number six yet i still want to do a few more number 19s you know filling the amalgam on those so probably gonna do that because our competency is next week and i'll be on the ski trip this weekend so i would like to practice as much as possible so i'm gonna eat my lunch and i will see you in operative Vicky, I'm watching your technique today. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. 
I'm looking at her technique. <laughs> oh, is it good? I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> Wait, aren't you? Don't you have like YouTube? Yes. Is this going on YouTube? Yes. Okay. We're judging her right now. Do you have a timer? No, I. My 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 brain. Oh. <laughs> I was there. We were like, we're in the corner. Okay. See, I can thing. never get this because I only have two hands. You would get the elevator. See. What do you mean? I have two hands. No, I'm saying like when I'm filming myself, no. I can't see. It. Oh. <laughs> Gotta pack that real good. How many pounds of pressure are you supposed to be putting? Eight. Yep. Gold star. Thank you. Really? They tell you that? Yeah. yeah. It says six to ten, but they I said mean, eight. No. <laughs> this feels like eight pounds. Okay. You're drilling out the most recent one. No, I did one just now, but it's not. Oh. That Do you see improvement in your marginal ridge? Uh, nope. <laughs> I don't know. I practice enough. Oh, I'm no. Not doing, I'm, not, I'm not like making any like improvements. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm doing something wrong. Did you ask faculty for help? Nope. That's probably why. I can do it by myself. They can give you. Know, you... <laughs> Doing it by yourself. I don't need help. They can give you good advice. Yeah, I know. Oh, okay. Are you recording this? Yes. Like I said, <laughs> don't need any help. That's how stubborn I am. Oh my gosh. I'm a self-made dentist. <laughs> Learned at YouTube University School of Dental Medicine. <laughs> You go to class though, it's yeah, fine. True. Okay, so it's Wednesday and I didn't have class this morning. It got canceled, so I was like, thank you God. <laughs> Um, I wasn't really planning on going anyways, but that lecture is actually not going to be on the exam So that's fun. That's five less questions. We have to be tested on but I think I've been giving myself a little too much self-care <laughs> And sleeping and oh, I should mention Andy never signed the the new contract <laughs> For our bet so that's kind of also why my motivation has been low to go to class I, It's really sad, but like I do need to kind of like an incentive to go to class sometimes and winning is always a good incentive you know <laughs> but right now I just I can't get it together my motivation is super low and this is just how it is sometimes like this is not anything new to me in my master's program that's happened to me as well I wouldn't say I'm burnout I'm just oh rascal doesn't agree with that I wouldn't say that I'm burnout I just think I haven't been disciplined that's what it's come down to motivation is not always going to be there and so when it's not you have to be disciplined enough to kind of fight through the grogginess or the, the lack of motivation and I just been like ah, self-care we'll sleep in or self-care I'm gonna watch a lot of YouTube or whatever you I do to procrastinate so for me I think I need to start setting some boundaries for myself Okay, so I moved over here so that you can kind of see the bullet points of what my my game plan is. So number one, I think I need to limit my screen time. I think I have my phone too accessible to me sometimes when I'm studying and I can easily just scroll on Instagram and I had to turn off some of my notifications on my phone because I would check every time and that's so bad. So I think I need to put it on do not disturb and just set it aside when I'm studying like, and I wanna get stuff done. Another thing I'm gonna do is keep track of my time. I kinda of started slacking on that this past few weeks. I think it really helps me see my, pro my productivity levels. And if I see it in my calendar, I'm like, I did nothing today, like that upsets me. So I need to start keeping track of my time again. And there is just, I think, waking up early and it that's the hardest one for me but just making sure that I'm disciplined and going to class because even if I'm passively listening sometimes that information does stick in there and it, it will help me so going to class actively listening waking up early that's kind of like one <laughs> big point so 
hopefully next week I'll be better. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I'm just a mess. I don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow on my operative exam because I haven't really studied, so. So I'm probably gonna be cramming for that and then I have a tissue injury and host defense exam on Thursday, bright and early, 9.15. <sighs> So I'm about to leave soon for a follow-up on my gum graft. So you can kind of see some of the uh, stitches that are in there. They are not dissolvable. So they are going to be in there a while. <laughs> I don't know when she's going to take them out. She said six weeks, but that seems like a long time. I'm not sure. I think I should stop talking now. Let's just focus on the rest of the day slash week. How do you feel, Tim? I feel like I could have played two all last night. I think I would have done better. I would have done better if I didn't study. This boy was texting me, let's play coup. I'm like, no, I'm gonna fail this exam. I haven't studied. <laughs> Please disregard the craziness that is my hair. It's reflective of my mood right now. <laughs> my vibe. So I guess I should talk about the exam I took this morning. A lot of us were fighting about the answers. <laughs> my group of friends, we usually go over the exams after we kind of like fight each other about what we think was right or wrong. And some people are just run away from that they're like don't want to talk about the exam don't even tell me anything because I don't want to know and that's not our group we're the opposite we're like no it was this it was that and it's funny to me and I enjoy it and it kind of tells me like oh definitely got that stuff wrong but there is always a good dose of humble pie every time I'm listening to my friends who again are like way smarter than me and they're like no it was definitely this I'm like Oh, I didn't put that. So I'm just like doing tallies in my head of like wrong, 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 wrong. I still haven't gotten it together since yesterday. I think my mindset is just like so focused on the ski trip that I'm going to be going on tomorrow that my brain is just ready to vacation. <laughs> it's like we don't need to study. We're going skiing tomorrow or Saturday. Ugh. Look at me. How do you feel about this exam? 25 sitting on 25 mil. How you feel? 25 sitting on 25 mil. Oh my god. Well, I'm just trying to minimize Was that exam hard? It was pretty hard for studying for 24 hours. Like, not gonna lie, I feel like a low key fail. But there's a little more exam. No, no, no. I feel like a lot of people feel like they fail, no, like, but they get a lot of questions know. that they I lack. I, I want to go back. I didn't study though. That's fine. Uh, it's, been it's, it's, it's been a rough week. It has been a rough week. I studied too much for operative, and I just didn't study enough in general. But we're going skiing today. We're going skiing. It's fun. It's fun. We're good. All good. Are we gonna fail out of D1 year? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> no, sir. I do feel good about this exam. Oh. Yeah, it's funny. It's pretty good since we've through so far. Okay. Um, it's gonna be but, the best one. I don't know. But did you. I'm doing <laughs> on the other one, so hopefully. Uh, but you studied a good amount, though, right? Think of questions. <laughs> Everything I've, we've gone over, I've gotten wrong. Yeah, me too. Me too, Jeannie. You're not alone. So I wasn't as organized and prepared for exams like I usually am. But that's just life. Like sometimes you're just going to have an off week. And even if I end up not doing really well on this exam, um, that's okay because like it is what it is. I'm not going to let one grade affect me. Um, now I can focus on getting my ski gear. And I'm gonna be leaving in a few hours, so <laughs> I'm gonna close out the vlog here. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new, please subscribe down below. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.